Hey you guys, so today we are looking at this which is the Star Wars Black Series Star Wars The Old Republic Darth Malgus I hope I said that right, Malgus It's one of those names I've not heard many other people say um, Yes, it's a Star Wars figure My Star Wars reviews do not get a lot of views Which is a shame because I am a huge Star Wars fan It was part of the reason I started this channel but you guys just don't watch the Star Wars videos. So, I still buy the figures because I like them. This one was one of those where I, I pre-ordered it ages and ages and ages ago from um, from Has Hasbro Pulse. And yeah, I kind of, I kind of forgot I'd pre-ordered it. <clears throat> Which is always a bad sign. Anyway, let's have a look at this. So we have Star Wars The Old Republic. Plastic free packaging, nice artwork down the side there, which I presume when you put all the figures together makes nice artwork on the back, all the legalese and stuff, pictures down the side there, how big he is, etc. Let's have a quick look, there we go. 7.0 inches and 17.8 centimeters. So there you go. I guess that's how tall he is. On the back, it says, voiceover guy, go on, come on, because you might as well do this, because probably nobody's watching this video. So, Darth Malgus, a legendary Sith Lord, Darth Malgus emerges from hiding with a mysterious plan that could secure his legacy in the annals of the Sith. I think it's annals. But we'll go with that, because, like we said... Probably nobody's watching this video. <laughs> we could do anything in this video because, like, nobody will watch it. It'll get, like, less than 100 views. I'll put a bet on, oh, yeah. I'll put a bet on with you right now. I will, I don't know, do something dumb on video. If this gets more than 100 views um, in the first two days. Yeah, there we go. There's a challenge. So more than 100 views, I will do something strange. Yeah, I can't think what yet, but I will do it. Oh look, another one of those. <laughs> Put it on the pile. All right, let's get him out of there. There we go. Da, 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 da. Ooh, so lightsabers are nicely and safely packaged. Down the side, put the knife away. Da, 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 da. So yeah, how are you all you guys? Yeah, you good? I've had a long a long hard day at work today and I got home and this was sitting on the doorstep waiting for me so I was like yay like I say I forgot I ordered it uh, right another box now you see they've put some nice paper around this with towels on it gaming greats I really do need to play the game I know kind of bits of it, but I do need to, I think you can play on the Switch. I may get it for the Switch. Oh, his feet. <laughs> he looks like the Wicked Witch of the West or the East. Whichever one gets house dropped on her when her feet curl up. What voice of a guy? You got that one? Where's the false Joe? Yeah. All right, so let's get, I like the, I like the hood. It's very nice. Articulation wise, there we go, right. His feet are now flat. He's a he's a big chap, I have to say. He stands, like I said, he's he's tall. Hmm. I like the look of this. Let's have an extreme close-up. There we go. Has the shiny thing on his chest. I'm trying to see if that yeah, it's shiny. I'm trying to see if it was transparent. There's some nice paint details on this. There's some very nice design. Yeah, so everybody in here is now trying to figure out what I'm going to do if this gets over 100 views in the next two days. Hmm. Well, I could I could do a video of topless. Yes, I could. But that wouldn't really work, would it? So yes, the cloak is nice. The back there will just flip that up. There's some nice detail underneath it, actually, I have to say. So you're never going to really see it because it's the side that will be facing the wall and have a cloak over it. 
Is this a cloak? What would this be called? Because it's got a hood on it. And this. Is it a cloak? Comments underneath. You know what to do. All three of you that are probably watching this video. I like the I like the detail on this. I have to say, they have put a little bit of effort onto this. But let's have a look at the head. Wow! Now that that is nice. I don't know if the camera is picking this up as well as it looks, but there is some really nice skin texture on there and colouring. It does look. It, do you know it reminds? Me? Okay, <laughs> Star Wars reference. Because this is a Star Wars figure, it reminds me of the, the Vader when he is taken out of his let me see you with my own eyes, that moment. Yeah, I like that. It's kind of got burn marks down the side there. Is this? Oh, that does move down. Okay, is it removable? Not quite, but there is, there is the mouth under there. Let's see if we can turn that back a little bit. Sorry about the dirt. I'm trying to hide my fingernails because I've scrubbed them for like 10 minutes and the dirt will not come out. It's part of my new job and I get very dirty hands and I cannot. I keep telling the boss my hands are famous. <laughs> Just my hands. The rest of me, nobody knows. But my hands are very famous. Well, reasonably famous. So yeah, there is. I've got this kind of burn marks down that side there. Which is pretty cool. I get that because the light's tripping out. Yeah, that is nice. Yeah, that. I'm going to respirate. So, articulation-wise, the the respirator thing. I'm going to move it. Like, I know my thumb's in the way. Does move with his with his face. She's good. The shoulder pads are glued in at the back there, so that gives his shoulders a nice amount of movement. There is a butterfly joint underneath there but not the most movable because of this part of the body armour. Um, the elbows they are jointless but they only get to about there. He has swivel in that top section and in the waist but not a lot of backwards and forwards there just a little bit of tilt. So interesting the head tilt. The head does tilt to the side that's good. There's tilt to either side. I am liking this guy. This is meaning now I'm going to have to buy the other figures from this. The other two. I have some other... I need to play the games. I know I do. I played them a long time ago. The, the first time they were out. I think I played it on the Xbox. Maybe 360. And I did enjoy it. But I got to a level and I think I screwed up somewhere and it kind of locked. I, I couldn't get any further with it because it was like, go talk to him, then go talk to him. And he'd tell me to go to talk to him and then he'd tell me to go talk. And I was like, I'm not getting any further. And I kind of gave up. My articulation is nice as well. Yeah. Knee articulation. Not the most... It's not going to be a butt kicker, but... There's, there's manoeuvrability in there. The feet have got the nice swivel on there, as we can see, and pivot. Pivot! Yes, thank you. Yeah, that's got a nice amount of manoeuvrability. So you are going to get him into some very dramatic poses. That kind of thing. What do you think? Hood up or down? I like the hood down because it shows off this really nice cranium. Let's have a look at the lightsaber which I've left strategically in the packet. It's not going to come out of it. Oh, it did. So we have. Do that. Got that is a nice a nice hilt. Is it removable? I'm not even going to try it because it needs warming. I presume it will be. Most of them are. Doesn't look to be anywhere to hang it. So I may just leave it like that. So let's see. Yeah. 
I'm liking this guy. I like I say, I have no history for him, but I think he looks really, really cool. And I am going to investigate more about him. Definitely going to investigate more about him. I'll uh, just give you an idea of how much bigger he is. There is... Well, guys, there we go. We'll put those next to him. He is a lot taller. He's probably going to be standing on the shelf with these guys, so I might as well be in the video with them. Yeah. Cool. I like it. I think it is a really, really... This is, this is what we want, Hasbro, from our Black Series and things like that. We want these kind of figures. This is what we want them to look like. It's kind of weird that this, which is a real second, I don't mean it in a nasty way, but a secondary figure. It's not a figure that you'd go, you know, like, I'm just looking up there at my, my collection. The, the Han Solo, I don't think they've got his face right yet on any of them. The Princess Leia, the Hoth ones, the Empire Strikes Back ones are quite good. Mark Hamill, Luke, when they feel like it, they can get him right. Other ones are great. But the main cast, they sometimes get wrong. But this guy, look at that, look at that cranium. That is a cool look. Just look at it. The skin colour, I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but the skin colour is really, really creepy. Yeah. So, we're going to keep this short and sweet. And I will wind this up. So, if you have enjoyed this video and you're new here. <laughs> yep, it's a Star Wars video. Hit the like, shares and subscribe down there. Please hit that subscribe button. It really, really helps the channel. Thank you to those of you that have recently subscribed. You know who you are. Thank you so much. It's been a big help. <laughs> with my grubby thumbnails. Um, yeah, I've, I've got this new job. And I, I'm working with dirt sometimes. So, yeah. I'm not going to tell you what it is because I like to keep secrets. <laughs> so yeah, this guy is is definitely going to I'm definitely going to give him pride of place on the shelf. I think he definitely deserves it. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you all have a great day. Hope you have a great night. Don't forget, this needs to get over a hundred in the next two days. Yeah, over a hundred in the next two days. I'm guessing it will probably get to about sixty. Sixty, some poss poss possibly. Um, I have lots of Star Wars videos there. Go watch them. So yeah, have a great day, a great night, and we will see you all in the next video. May the Force be with you. <laughs>